welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you with the following question which says In the following, state whether A is equal to B or not. So first let us learn what are equal sets. Two sets are said to be equal If they have exactly the same elements. Otherwise, the sets are called unequal sets. That is, those sets which are not equal are unequal sets. So, this is the key idea we are going to use in this problem to find its solution. Let us now start with the solution. And the first one is A is a set containing elements A, B, C and D. And B is the set containing elements D, C, B and A. Now we see that these two sets have exactly the same elements. A is in the set A also and B also. B is also in the set A also and B also. C is also in the set A and B and D is also in the set A and B. So both the sets A and B contain four elements which are exactly the same. Thus, we can say, yes, A is equal to B. This completes the first part. And now proceeding on to the second part, where A is equal to 4, 8, 12 and 16. And B is the set which contains element 8, 4, 16 and 18. Now on observing these two sets, we find that there are four elements in set A and four elements in set B, but 12, which is an element of set A, is not an element of set B. Similarly, here 18, which belongs to set B, does not belong to set A. So this implies these two sets are unequal. Hence our answer is no. The set A is not equal to B. So this completes the second part. Now proceeding on to the third part. Where A is the set containing elements 2, 4, 6, 8 and 10. And B is the set which contains all those X such that X is a positive even integer. And also X is less than or equal to 10. So the upper limit is 10. And we have to write all those positive integers which are less than or equal to 10. So the smallest is 2. Then we have 4, 6 and 8. So this is the set B. Now on observing set A and B, we find that there are 5 elements in both these sets. And they are exactly the same. Thus we can say that, yes, set A is equal to set B. This completes the third part. And now proceeding on to the last part. Where A is a set which contains all those X such that X is a multiple of 10. And B is the set which contains 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, and so on. Now first
first let us write the elements in the set A. Now A contains all those elements x such that x is a multiple of 10. So there are many multiples of 10. That is when any number multiplied with 10 results in a multiple of 10. So minus infinity is starting from and we have minus 20, minus 10, 0. 0 we get on multiplying 10 with 0. Then we have 10 which we get on multiplying 10 with 1. Then 20, then 30 and so on up to infinity. And on observing A and B we find that 15 which is in set B is not in set A. And thus the two sets A and B are not equal. Thus our answer is no. So this completes the last part and that's the solution. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care and have a good day.